running, running, running. Never before had I truly known myself. My whole life I was scared. Fear cloaked behind extroverted tendencies and guaranteed confidence, and this fearfulness led me straight to the river of delusion. Avoid, avoid, avoid. Avoiding anything that grounded me back to a reality in which I was met with my fears, scarcities, and insecurities. Unknown to me was the truth that to move through these fears, I couldn't go around them or put them to the side or chill at the stop sign before them. To move past, I must move through, and I didn't know until I did. Until I began to feel the effects of avoidance. As clarity crept into my life, I was faced with the knowing that I didn't even know myself. Who was I? Who had I been? Who was I going to be? I didn't know. Wounded by the fog that sets place over our hearts to be protected. I knew I needed to allow it to be free, to evaporate from my feet where I would feel the ground, grounded in the certainty and trust in myself. At first, as the fog cleared, I was more fearful than ever. The tendencies that kept me protected were beginning to lessen, and with this, my vulnerable heart felt more and more open and more and more pain flooded through. But with each point of pain came a deeper understanding of myself. Because when I looked around, in the moments I felt alone, I realized I had nothing except myself. Through this, I began to know myself through time, space, play, meditation. And then there was this moment that I felt it like I was not alone. Something else had been holding my hand this whole time, light, source, knowing, trust. I had never believed in God, just a vague version of the universal powers that I knew nothing about. I trusted little and feared a lot. But with this deeper knowing and understanding in myself, it actually led me to my core, the light that exists within each of us. For myself, I was running and running and boom, I have arrived. Present, connected, worth knowing, I have arrived. And so have you to this life, to this moment, to get to know ourselves deeper, to explore, play, understand, knowing that we might not have it figured out all the fucking time and healing isn't linear. And sometimes pain exists and then it goes away and then it comes back. But we are meeting ourselves with love and grace. We're going deeper, deeper, deeper. And this is Skinny Debate, the rebirth. Who's ready to strip down and dive in?